Jessica Marie here on Rock Me TV at the 2009 Indie Gathering in Westlake at the Holiday Inn in Cleveland, Ohio. Stick around because we're going to be having short films, clips, interviews, and all kinds of things going on. So don't shrink that screen. Stay on Rock Me TV. This is Tangie from Rock Me TV, and I'm here with these three handsome gentlemen who have put out this movie, The Notorious Newman Brothers. So we're going to talk to them a little bit about that. Why don't you guys tell me a little bit about how this went and what you guys did? Well, uh, basically it was a real team collaboration. Uh, Ryan Wells, the director, my brother and I are co-writers along with Ryan. And uh, we star as the Newman brothers in the film and we're brothers in real life. So that makes it easy. So yeah, you two are the brothers. 80%, 10%, 10% right there. Now 10%, we have to figure out. So these two are, you two are actually brothers. Yeah. Here. Now yeah. how do you fit in everything? Real well, real well. Real well. Um, he fits right is in the this, middle. Oh, he's, right in the, he's middle. the wannabe brother. Does this, is this your ticket in to the family? That's, uh, that's for mom and pa butler. Just want to let you know that uh, I'd be a really good butler brother. This is audi uh, his audition <laughs> tape here. Yeah, mom, yeah. Like, don't listen to him. Unacceptable. Nah, nah, not good enough. Keep him away from us. I understand. So where did you guys come up with the idea for this? Uh, basically, I was shooting a uh, short film and Brett and Jay were a part of that. They were playing these uh, gangster type. And uh, I came to check up on them to see what was taking them so long. At the time, Brett had long hair, and uh, he was conflicted what looked tougher, hair up or hair down. So I couldn't decide on doing the ponytail or not. <laughs> well, yeah, it's a good it's question. And, it looks good uh, both is, ways. Is that yeah. under there? Uh, not anymore. It's all, no, it's uh, gone now. It's okay, gone. I see. So basically, it was just... It's a kind of a ridiculous premise for a gangster film, you know, behind the scenes, what goes on in their heads. So. The real questions the gangsters real questions. ask themselves before they go and whack someone. Yeah, now, like, I what learned, tie looks best, you know, that kind of shit. I Better learned represent. a new word today, mockumentary. Tell me a little bit about what, what mockumentary is. Oh, well, basically, I mean, it's a, it's a mock documentary, sort of, uh, I guess... The grandfather would be uh, this is Spinal Tap, which ours is definitely like it's kind of a Sopranos meets uh, Spinal Tap kind of thing. And is this is this released, or are you guys looking to release this? We're actually we're just, that one? yeah, well we're doing the uh, festival circuit right now, so we're okay. touring around with it and um, just kind of starting out, getting a lot of really good positive feedback. And uh, yeah, we'll see where it takes us. He keeps taking this from me. I'm gonna take it back from well, him now. You gotta give buy me, it. Ten dollars. Give me that. Okay, so. <laughs> Yeah, we are kind of traveling around, trying to get uh, get groupies, stuff like that, kind of doing the rock and roll uh, touring. That's how we got into filmmaking. We're for groupies and free booze. So far, so good. Sex, drugs, and movies. Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> On that note, everybody look for the Notorious Newman Brothers with the two real brothers and the wannabe brother here. This is Tangie for Rock Me TV. Don't shrink that screen.